And the nine-year-old girl who went missing in upstate New York is thankfully back home with her family tonight. This is we learn more about the man accused of abducting her. CBS 2's Jennifer Bisram on the piece of evidence that led police to the suspect. I've been praying for 48 hours since I got the first Amber Alert. Relief in Saratoga County Tuesday after an outcome not every family gets. Little Charlotte safely reunited with her parents after a terrifying 48 hours. Police say SWAT teams closed in on the suspect, Craig Ross, after matching fingerprints on a ransom note to a state database. Assuming they were not home, 420 in the morning opens the mailbox and inserts the ransom note, leaving a critical piece of evidence behind his own fingerprint. They then found Charlotte Senna hidden in a cabinet in a trailer behind Ross's mother's home. One neighbor tells CBS2 her grandson once had an eerie encounter with Ross. And I believe with all my heart after last night that probably my grandson was this close. Authorities say it all started Saturday evening when the nine-year-old went for a bike ride around 6.15. At 6.45, her bike was found along the upstate New York Trail. She was then reported missing. Sunday morning, an Amber Alert was issued, and Monday morning was when investigators got the clue that would lead to her rescue. We live right here in this neighborhood, and we're all just breathing a sigh of relief, not just, you know, for them and her, and her children, but for all of the children in the neighborhood. Craig Ross has been charged with kidnapping with intent to collect ransom. Authorities say more charges are expected. Jennifer Bisram, CBS 2 News.